Hello and welcome to Old Lady Plays. I'm Kate, the Old Lady, and this is Versus 5, Episode 2 of A Versus Save. And very briefly, what's going on here is that I am facing off against United City FM, the great, great competitor, uh, and we are both managing Sassuolo in Serie A in Italy, with the goal that whoever gets the most points in the league will gain one point for their team. Their team is either Team Rest of the World, that's me, or Team GB, which is the United City FM. And at the end of all five challenges, whichever team has more points, that's the winner. Anyway, that's all we got for now. I'm going to be handing it over to my past self, and we're going to talk about how things have been going. I'll see you later. Alright, here we are. Welcome in, ladies and gentlemen. It's time for Versus 5, Episode 2. And I'm excited because things have been going pretty well. As you can tell by looking at the screen here, you will notice that they are all in excellent and superb form. Um, or morale, I should say, which is really good. We're kind of happy with that. And there's some green in our last five games, which is pretty nice. And there's some green in our average ratings, which is also nice. And somebody's got seven goals already in eight games. That's pretty nice. Scoring 0.91 goals per 90. That's pretty good. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Francesco Caputo, who's bagged seven goals in eight games so far. Not bad. Um, I'm curious to see... Oh! We're in second. I wasn't looking to see that. I was trying to see whether he was, yes, tied for the leading scorer with Lukaku and, and Lukaku and Immobile. So that's pretty cool. I'm rather happy with that. I think he's doing all right for a 32-year-old or something. I think he's 32. 33. Good for him. Um, so, yeah, everybody's been playing very well, and let's just have a quick peek at how we've been doing, because, oh gosh, we lost that first game against Lazio. Tough match, tough game, we, they came back on us, we were up 2-0, and they came back, and we lost 3-2, and you saw it, I'm just recapping. Um, we played Genoa, we had a man sent off in the 34th minute, so not good. And we went on to win the game. So, uh, kind of nice there. Uh, we went up, they came back. We went up again. They came back. We went up a third time. They did not come back. We beat Torino 2-1. With, again, a man sent off. But in their on their side this time. Juricic and Maxim Lopez getting the goals. Milan. We got one goal from um, Ihan when he scored a penalty late in the game, and we took that win and ran with it. Grotone. Berardi scored a penalty, Maxim Lopez, and a brace from Caputo. So that went well. Cagliari. Uh, they had a man sent off in the 95th minute or something like that, but we would managed to, to win it by then anyway. Um, so it's all good. Atalanta, our first bletch on the record since the Lazio match. We got a draw, and once again a man was sent off, this time for Atalanta. Um, yeah, we've had a lot of red cards in games this season. Only one for our side, but my goodness, there's been a lot of red cards. Um, Caputo with goal and Raspadori. And, oh, look, another red card. Bologna has a man sent off. In the 82nd minute, after we'd scored two in the first half, Caputo and Locatelli getting the goals. And then, of course, we have Hellas Verona. We just played them right quite recently. Francesco Caputo with a goal and another one, a penalty and another goal, and Berardi with a 91st minute, just to slap him in the face. So, today we face Olimpico, 
and Roma. That's going to be an interesting place to be. They are sitting in eighth. We are sitting in second with a game in hand over Zebra. And we're only two points behind them. So we were actually in first place until they played that extra game. So this game catches us up. If we manage to win it, we will be back in first place overall. Kind of happy with that. So yeah, that's the way things have gone. There were no more transfers or anything. I did not bring in anybody else. I don't believe anyway. Uh, nope, Cataldi was the only one that I brought in. Um, so yeah, he hasn't actually scored yet, but he's done some damage with his free kicks in terms of setting up other goals and things like that. So I'm, I'm happy. Uh, I'm happy with that purchase. He's only getting a 6.85, but I, I think he's done fairly well, and his recent games over seven, kind of like that. So that's how things have been going. Um, and just once more, for uh, the sake of custard profit, there is your league table. Uh, we're doing all right, 22 points so far. Kind of happy about that. All right let's have a look at today's match today's match is Roma and we're going to do that with the opposition instructions and there's the team set up okay Consiglia in goal Kyriakopoulos on the left Kan Aichan uh, on the in the mid in midfield in the center backs with Marlon uh, Mert Mulder on the right. Cataldi behind Locatelli and Lopez in the midfield. Boga to the left, Berardi to the right. Caputo up front on his complete forward duty. He is ready to roll. Let's go. Six minutes of chatter. Sorry about that, but hey, we're going to do our best to get through this together. Media have given you a lot of credit lately. Let's go out there and put on a worthy display. Look at that. Away at Roma. Can we get something here? The recent struggles have them 15th in the form table. Uh, only a fool would disregard their ability in favor of form. Yep. How do you intend to stop the inform somebody or other? I know what he's capable of, and we're going to screw him up somehow I don't know we're gonna do something to him I didn't really pay attention to my answer <laughs> that's not very good but there it is okay let's go let's go let's go let's go let's go oh jump to it jump to it let's go thank you I know I could have hit skip any time, but it just seemed disrespectful. I don't know why. Anyway, 15 minutes, nobody's shot anything yet. They've got the possession edge. Finally, they've laid in a shot, but not much of one. Well taken. Boga's in there. The Ivorian all the way back and again this time for Kyriakopoulos Kyriakopoulos Cataldi and forward finally to Boga cuts inside and oh hello slips it through for Lopez Lopez meets his man finds Berardi oh but it's just taken off his foot at the last moment and it looks like a corner is going to be called there. That's what it is. I still haven't set the corner routines. I really should do that. I have a fairly effective one. Oh, good play, keeper. Well done, well done. Now, we've had two shots, both on target. And with better XG than their shots, so that's good. Oh gosh, look at that chance. That was amazing. What a shot. Uh, what a pass, I mean. 
It just wow, woo, woo. Boys are playing well. Merrick Mulder, Lopez crosses. Locatelli heads it in. We are up one. Top of the league. We said we are top of the league. That's how it goes. We are up. Third shot of the game goes in off Lucatelli's head. And Lopez's cross stands it up beautifully for the back post. The Roma defender misses it. Looks like a fullback. And Lucatelli just buries it. I cannot complain about that. We're doing very well. We've outshot them. We've now got the possession edge. Oh, just got there in time, Merrick Mulder. Khan. A wide for Kyriakopoulos. Boga cutting inside. Whew. Hammers a shot just over the bar. Just before half time, and we'll call that a pretty good half. Um, do, 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 do. Don't get complacent out there. Oh, oh, seem demotivated. We've got a couple of guys demotivated. This is not good. We will go to individuals and see if we can motivate them again. And I have faith in you. Let's see if we get there. Uh, we got one of them. Goalkeeper still demotivated. Sorry about that, keeper. Keep your chin up. Good play. Get there first. That's it. Berardi's on it. Berardi up with Caputo. Caputo through. Oh, and he misses. All right. Roma playing it around in my end. Villar. Perez, Kyriakopoulos, of course, the left back. The full back is always the one when a penalty gets called. It's always my full backs. I don't know why he's such a good full back and he doesn't do that. And yet here we are. My goodness you missed the penalty I I missed the penalty I was looking down <laughs> I was just scratching myself I looked down and I missed the penalty that they missed my goodness but we'll take it we're still up one nil and oh I'm not gonna interrupt the highlight let's see what we can do here Cataldi with the corner That's a good one, but doesn't find his own man. Oh, another one off the bar. Oh, no, it was offside. Okay. Now we can do this. Let's get in there and get some fresh legs out there. Boga can come out for Juricic. And Locatelli. Do, 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 do. Um... Let's go with Traore. Yeah, I'm interested to see what he can do. Let's give him a shot. For five minutes. Not much of a shot. But that's the way. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I like it. Uh-huh, uh-huh. One nil win over Roma at at Roma. My goodness, well done lads, that was a good win for us. I am happy. How long do you think this unbeaten run can last? Is it realistic to expect to continue? Uh, I think if you look at our fixtures, you will think that we could go on a while yet? No, I think if you look at our fixtures, you will think it will not go on. Um, we'll expect it to not remain perfect, that's why. Um, 
that wind has put your side top. Can you do you think you can make that spot your own? Um, it will be tough, but that's football. <laughs> We're back on top after 10 matches with 25 points. So there's your league table. Hang on, Custard Profit. I'll get you a good one to use in your video for just a moment. Sassuolo make it 9 unbeaten. That's pretty good. I'm pretty happy with that. Um, there was a drawing there. That's right. Yes, Atalanta. Um, I'll deal with the press conference offline. We'll be back. Um, check out the dynamics of this team already early in the season. Everything is just looking beautiful. I'm very happy. Uh, social groups. Ihan is still not getting to fit in yet. But Cataldi's found his way into a group already. So that's good. I'm happy with that. Yeah, that's going to do it for this episode, I guess. We're going to be back. Uh, la 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 la. I believe for this Parma match is the one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nineteen is the one. So, yes, that's the game. We'll be back for this Parma match. And, uh, Hopefully, we'll be able to do fairly well. But as you can see, we've got a bit of a rough run coming up. Not Sampdoria, but uh, Zebra, Inter, and Napoli. Um, to some extent, Fiorentina, all in a row. So that's going to be that's going to be a bit of a, a rough stretch. Two of them are away games, especially Zebra. That's going to be challenging. So we'll see how we get on, but. Um, but yeah, I'd say things are off to a pretty good start. Back to you, United City FM. Anyway, that's going to do it for this episode. I hope you've enjoyed it. Thank you very much for watching. I look forward to seeing you again in the next episode. Thank you very much. I hope you have a great day and take care.